Okay, I just uh seeing all the thing that a scar telling me, and now I think I will try to, to translating it with my own interpretation. But we'll see. Well done. You didn't let any details slip. Now I wonder, what is your takeaway from this story? Like wait, oh, I don't know, man. Can we Answer just go to the detail first? The truth of what happened. Who was the real culprit behind the diminishing number of lambs? Shepherd, the white lamb, the black lamb. Lamb. I think the white lamb, not the shepherd, not the black lamb. The white lamb. Brilliant answer. You saw past the obvious. Yeah. The true culprit was not the shepherd. Yeah. The white lambs who chose, chose to, to follow, follow his rules. rule. Yeah, there you go. The shepherd never forced them into anything. Anything, yeah. It never really presented a choice. A possibility. a possibility. Yeah. No one would have been killed if they simply refrained from making those wishes. Those wishes, yeah. Their greed and indifference were the cause, cause of, it of it all. Yeah. Now, my second question. What price did the lambs pay for their wishes? Wishes. Ah, uh, that's sincerity. They must have poured their sincerity into it, no doubt. But that's not much of a price, is it? Here's my final question. Ah, uh, I'm wrong. What happened to the black lamb? The black lamb? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Don't rush, Rover. Take your time. What is the truth you've uncovered? It was murdered by its flock and a shepherd. It was executed because its flock was sheep. It was murdered by its flock and a shepherd. It was executed because its flock was deceived. The monster that say sister, if I am wrong, not mommy. It is survived along with another lamb, I guess. But the flock was deceived. It was murder. It was executed because it's it is flock was deceived. Yeah, I think this is. I still think the third one. It survived along with all another lamb. Oh yeah, they are sacrificing the shepherd. I think they are sacrificing the shepherd. The shepherd was granting wishes by sacrificing the lives of lambs. Yeah. The flock never found out about it. Someone came to their rescue. And they all made it out alive. Separate was granting wishes by sacrificing a life of one. The flock never found out about it. Someone came to their rescue. And they they all made it out one. <laughs> really? Oh, you're such a good little lamb. So innocent, so sweet. 
they saw the, the separate being sacrificed. Do you really believe a hero would show up and save the day? Little lambs cowered and huddled in their village, terrified of the relentless wolf packs. Until a shepherd arrived, bearing the gift of wishes and providing shelter and sustenance. Slowly, the shepherd gained control over the flock. Yeah. And the lambs lived contented lives. But this is not the end of our story. The shepherd found the solitary black lamb in his flock and offered to grant any wish it desired. In exchange, he wanted one of its companions as a sacrifice. sacrifice. What? The black lamb refused. And it was shunned by its flock, left without shelter or sustenance. Wow. After the black lamb's exile, more lambs continued it to vanish. Bad. The shepherd then blamed the black lamb for breaking the rules. Yeah. And withheld his wish granting power as punishment. knew the risk of making wishes yeah they too could become sacrifices for those of others yeah but they are still they doing it believed it wouldn't be them it wouldn't be them yeah meanwhile some lambs reasoned that since they had already risked being sacrificed for someone else's wish it was then only fair to pass on that risk for a chance at fulfilling their own Only desires. Sucks. And so they continued to play the game. Wow. They all knew the consequences but chose to remain silent. Wow. Fearful, yet greedy. They followed the shepherd's orders and made wishes again, again. And, again. And, again. and again and again. One day, a brave black lamb spoke up. Shattering the flock's facade, their illusion of a peaceful and happy life. life. Yeah. Suddenly, they could no longer ignore the blood. Right. my story rover wow what really happened here i suppose you already have it figured out yeah it's been killed so the little girl be being killed by all the villager the black lamb who rebelled against the rules and the white lambs who succumbed to their greed the innocent maiden sacrificed and the villagers who turned on each other in a ruthless frenzy. frenzy. Yeah. They had it coming. All the shepherd had to do was execute the rebel. Yeah. That's how he kept the flock in check and maintained, and maintained the status quo. Yeah. Is that why you become a separate yourself? Answer, but no, not even close. I was never the shepherd, never will be. Oh, will be you, you and I. We, we are, are the black, black lamb. lamb, yeah. The one who breaks Break the, rules. the rules, yeah. There you go. Oh man, this is so good, man. The story is so good. So, I, I made mistake twice. I think about the middle one in the last one, the second, the second one, I made mistake. But the third, the third one, I should choosing the middle one. So I think that's it. One from three. 
at least I'm not uh, wrong or all wrong. So thank you so much. See you again next time. Bye.